Hello guys, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3, a game of thrones, where we are continuing as House of Baratheon. But, as I mentioned at the end of the last session, we will be making a few considerations, and we have returned to the Faith of the Seven. Uh, didn't seem to change our banner back, but uh, we've returned to the Faith so that we could find possible suitors who may be interested in us upon the throne. As we do have a claim on it. Oh no, we have to check me. We do have a claim on it from our belief that Joffrey is a bastard. Uh, and to support us uh, through marriage, we have the Reach and the Tullys, who uh, will also probably be joining us in this war here against Roderick Sharpspear. Let's. Oh. Which Renly? I'll get a random Renly, doesn't matter then. Oh, yeah, the Reach and Ribbons are going to join in. Let's raise our armies. So, this war is, uh, as mentioned, to install. Uh, where is he? Let me just find him. No, it's not there. It is. Shireen, yeah. So Shire, it is Faeron's claim, as when Faeron dies, it would pass to Godry, who is a Baratheon, and is more likely to be loyal to us. Oh, a patron aspect. How's my prowess? It's okay. I think we. I think we'll go for. What's my diplomacy? Also, yeah, let's go for the father because I've. I'm more of a diplomacy character anyway. Hence why, you know, as being a diplomat, you know, it will make sense for me to choose uh, a route where in which I, oh yeah, with my son, where in which I'm uh, more, uh, finally that war ended, oh, I'm losing my mind, it makes more sense for me to change faith so that I have more diplomatic support, um, you know, it's it's the right move diplomatically. See sixteen k rising there. Where are the Tully troops? I assume they've risen somewhere. Yeah, the Reach is down here. Don't know where the Tullys are though. Let's meet up with the Reach. Hope the Tullys haven't tried to land. Uh, we should have the numbers advantage, but obviously the problem's going to be if they if they wanted to, they can just sit on their island and do nothing. Oh yeah, I could also call... It's a little bit of prestige, but I think... Let's call in the neck as well. It's very rare to marry into the Granite Men, but that... Uh... I mostly picked as I think the neck is a sort of underrated and quite an important area actually within a Game of Thrones. Why would I want? I don't want to claim on Golden Grove. That would be a very weird claim for Dragonstone to have. Wait, is so the new? Uh, still one cent. The new Lord of the Westlands is now Banefort in the Banefort. Do the Lannisters still own? He only owns Castle Rock, but, you know, he's still going to be rich. Getting six gold a month. Let's head up to the Bane Fort. Don't know where the Tully armies are. Are they in a separate wall? No. Where are your armies? Ah. Oh. How do I see to the preparations for that? You know I called you a bastard, so you probably wouldn't like me. Uh, I don't know. I'm sure there'll probably be an event that comes up. Okay, the Tullys just started getting themselves killed. That's what they're doing. We're going to have to land somewhere, I think. Okay, 21k Greyjoys are looking to land somewhere, by the looks of it. If we can take Pike before they take anything else, we've already won, basically. Yeah, they're just killing the Tullys over and over, and then these guys are joining for no good reason. 
get themselves killed. Let's speed up a little bit. Just while we're traveling. A spy discovered. My courtier brought in a cell. Where's the Reach army? Did they not land with me? I thought they specifically landed with me. Oh no, they landed into that fight by the looks of it. Yes, they did. Okay, they maybe did the smarter move, but I might get attacked here because you guys aren't coming to help. <laughs> I'm still going to stay on this siege and I'm going to hope. No, they're going to wipe me here. Unless these armies can get here quick. I'm going to speed up again. Oh, they are actually going to get here in time. Very good. Oh, my Admiral died. Let's get a new one. Oh, crap. No, I don't want to retreat. Uh, but yeah, I guess I'm retreating now. That's awkward. Let's return back to the siege. Didn't mean to retreat there. Another spy? Right on a cell. Okay. Looks like having an actually good council is what I need right now. Yeah, keep Lord Edwin on disrupt schemes. Uh, let's get you getting a bit more control. Um, don't need management domains. Okay, go on court politics then. Let's try and get my courtiers to like me again. Yeah, these overwhelming numbers should have the victory here. Mostly because they attacked in a very weird manner. But this will put Faerun in control, which hopefully, if there's ever a time where we want to push a claim, should grant us another ally. Or at least another supporter in our favour. I can appoint a new Fist of the Vanguard. I'll appoint Faerun, but he's about to lose that one, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> 35 on Lord Donald. Very impressive. He's a mighty warrior. Oh, a new perk for the martial lifestyle. How wonderful. Um, let's get the army movement speed. I like that one. Oh, it turns out I wasn't sieging Pike because I forgot Pike's this island. Oops. Well, no, I knew it was an island, but I didn't know that there was a specific uh, one for the island, I guess, is, is the the excuse I'm going with. <laughs> I didn't know. You can't blame me. Lysa sounds wonderful. Who's had the Liberty War? Oh my goodness. Fine. Have you allowed that to happen then? It's, it's just two people, but they've... <laughs> yeah, it's probably more are going to join after, I imagine. That's why he's worried. Either way, I can't help you until my war's dealt with. Five years to siege down Pike. No, I'm going to come help. Maybe this 12k here might want to come help. He really is in the wall. Yeah, you are ranting me off. I thought you are part of this wall, but you are part of the old wall. I don't think I'd be holding court in the middle of all this. Twenty days on Iron Holt. Let's stop being rivals. Oh, military engineer. Anyone to come help me with this siege? Nope, still no. 
four years. That's it, come on. He's formed a new alliance with the Lordship of Lime. One of the fake houses. Bet that'll go well for him. Oh, I need more money. He's legendary, though. I'm able to invite him to court. I'll recruit him because he seems legendary. If that's true, I want legendary stuff, please. Yeah, River Run's gonna fall. But I can't assist while I'm dealing with Pike. I don't need an aged cheese to be improved. I now have the two swords though, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this other sword. Still two years left on Pike. Yeah, let's get a bit more control growth. Now I actually want to move to... Oh, I still can't move yet. But I want to soon move to Diplomacy when I can. <laughs> Love how they're still hosting a Grand Tournament in the middle of all this. Sorry. The Warden of Sleeping Ruin all the way over there. Claims that Barbara is a... Yeah, I don't care about the Warden Ruin's opinion of me. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> I don't especially care what they think. I'm not going to pay homage. How long left? 22 months. Yeah, and you're about to fall. Unfortunate. It does mean I might have to bloody get the Tullys back in power if I want to have the Riverlands loyal again. If a war is to come. This all this is, it's about getting as many people loyal to my brand of the Baratheons as possible. And now everybody's come to siege on here, meaning they're going to siege these down again. Three years, three years. Okay, I should be done before then, right? Yes, yeah, it's got nine months on it. And hopefully that will end this war. And give us the control we need. And I have a powerful faction. Of course I do. What if I send you a gift? Mr. Donald, because I love you. Yay! Need to keep Donald loyal. Wonderful. And I know they're in the foreign land, but I'm good. Oh. This is a problem. I need to get them to a friendly area. My son has learned Valyrian. Good on him. So did he die during the war? Yes, he died very on early on during the war. That Lord Farron is now in command. And we have a mutual alliance with him. Wonderful, wonderful. This army can please disband. That makes it to the Riverlands a somewhat a lost cause here. I just need to get my armies back because we only have two, like 3,000 men now. Certainly not enough for our defence. Hmm. That's a bit of break up for me. Very well, your will be filled. I 
someone else is in my court. People want to deal. If you're going to deal, deal with training blades. Don't kill each other, please. It looks so bad on my uh, repertoire if you killed each other. The Righteous. Lord Humphrey the Righteous. What a wonderful name. Let's plan a hunt to get rid of these uh, beasts. Yes, yeah, so you have a link siding in this region. Let's do it in red plate. Oh, if I hire captives, it'll be above cost. Uh, that'll do then. Let's just keep inviting people. Hmm. I don't have a master of the hunt. Um. Lord Quentin seems to make the most sense. He's younger. He's strong. I'll need a new spy master. Uh, we'll go with Joey. Look at that. Our army's already getting back up. Let's seek the links. Let's get back on our horse. I will gain Mediator. Oh, so next to Diplomacy. We'll go with that. He is a diplomat after all. Right, this one gives a success chance. I always like going for the success chance once, for sure. Oh, and a learning challenge. Wonderful. Look at that. Having an actually smart person is useful for once. I will shoot it. I'll bring it down myself, which is a prowess challenge. Hmm. Use the hounds, or I could try and keep it alive, which won't give me a trophy. Let's go. Sp uh, I don't know. I like the pelt. Let's shoot it. Wonderful, and we get the pelt for doing so. Lynx fangs. Oh, Captain Effectiveness. Very nice. Let's return home. And he's... Why people keep putting things in their mouths? That seems like the most common event I've seen. See, we're just eating things. And then complaining that they ate something. Might find something inside. Oh, and I didn't even get wounded. Look at that. This guy's far more competent than any other Baratheon we've had. Because Stannis was weirdly un incompetent at times. I don't know what happened with him. <laughs> Very well, Lord. I mean, that one, though, I was just click because it seems to work the best. Okay, that's annoying. Some weird stuff in the game I had to take a look at. Don't know if it's fixed or not, but... That's certainly annoying. I'm not going to go bloody hunting. So this is just not a real hunt. It's just a hunt where you click a bunch of buttons and then they're like, Good hunt! Excellent hunt! Incredible work! Uh, I'm going to go for this one since I'm planning on taking a bunch of land in a second. Also, I don't know why I'm in this faction. Uh, I want to create a claimant faction for myself. I, oh no, I joined that faction to try and get the crown authority down, but that won't be needed anymore because I was able to edit my contract. Can I lead this army? Yeah, why not? I want to get myself a bit... not been able to lead an army in a little while. Why not? I don't think I need to call my allies for this war, honestly. A Baratheon Dynasty Splendor has gone up. That's the wrong one, what is it? It's, uh... Legacies. Yeah, we have full warfare now, and we're increasing on law. Oh my 
God. He's going to do this constantly because he hates me. Now he has a reason to imprison me because I'm declaring war on one province. Right, which is an new domain I got? Okay, it's in Krakow point, point. So let's grant this to a Stormlander. Because I want to get the, the duchy title here. So I can grant that duchy title to my nephew. I know, okay, he'll pardon me. I don't need the favour of a lady, I'll take the 40. Oh, I do, I need to have basically no knights, wow. I'll have to buy some knights when I can then. I can modify some contracts. No tax increase. Barely any soldiers, it's not worth it. They don't have enough for it to be worth it. Seize an artifact. Ooh. Learning per level of devotion is one I already have. So that'll just be a second one of those. A sheep tapestry. For fertility, I don't need that. Navy speed and stewardship lifestyle. That could be useful, but we'll keep the seven point star for now. If I ever have someone who's doing stewardship, I can appoint them there. Do I not have an Inquitarian? Oh, I don't have a lot of titles. Let's give some out. Court Smith. Master of Arms. Finally got the Reaver trait. Finally actually learned how to do it. Uh, lady in wait. Good. And then architect. There we go. My son has grown up. And he's a he's a decent web weaver. He's also a murderer at the age of sixteen. Um I believe that was an event where it was like for like father like son. And then he killed someone. So good job, son. Very impressed by your talent. He is unmarried though, you're alright. Could marry him to Princess Melisant. Is that Joffrey's? No, it's Joffrey's sister. So that'd be a bit brafly in inbreeding. Um, there's nobody else of real note here. Is the problem? So currently, I have support from, like, through an alliance, but maybe not support in a direct one from the Reach and the Riverlands. The Westlands is winner because these guys should be just flat out loyal to Joffrey because they were given this title by Joffrey. However, their only actual alliances with the Cape of Eagles. How's, what's the Vale like? The Vale has no allies and they're pretty meh at the moment. Yeah, Renly's going to directly always help them. And I've been rivals with Dawn for so long. But we're not rivals anymore. Hmm. Do I want to marry into Dawn? Let's look at what even options are. She's a bit too young, I think. She's only six. Does Maria have anybody? They're probably all going to be betrothed, right? Yeah. Okay. So they're not an option. Already, uh... I'm no longer allied with the Reach because Willis died. Bugger. They would take a, mar a marriage there, but there's a seven-year difference, which isn't great if I want to have a lot of kids there. What about you? No, I think securing a reach is, makes the most sense here. I think we should do this alliance. You still? Yeah, you're still alive at least. Lord Kirby. And then I also have a claim on these that I want to push. I might just do it at the same time, honestly. And then we grant this to... You seem kind of based. There we go, we caught them.
in my military. Do I want to get... Yeah, I want to get my trebuchets up a bit. To free, I think. Get these up as well. Right, let's go for the capitals. No, I'm not going to stand that again. Am I able to ask for a pardon again? I want to give it. What a wonderful guy. He's like, you've committed a crime. I want you to pay for it. And I'm like, no. And then he's like, you know what? You may have called me a bastard, but still no. It's very interesting. I wonder if it's because of the game. Because of the claim that he's more willing to work with me. But I, I have a specific claim on his title. So I would have thought he'd be less willing to work with me, you know? You're nine months on this siege. Oh, they're coming back again. Let's watch them lose. Hmm. Let's go with fear. I love people fearing me. I don't know who you are, but you died. <laughs> you pick up so many random rivals in this game. <laughs> when they die, you're just like, oh, don't remember you, but thank God you're dead. Yeah, that should be the last of their armies, by the looks of it. I do think once I have these two, that should be enough. Yeah, that looks like it will be enough to form crack or ploint. And then we can have another duchy title. Which, as far as I'm aware, may also mean that we're given these two or three. Oh no, it'll be these two because Rex Rex is its own. We'll be given these two by Joffrey because, um, the jure. And then that should be a pretty decent amount of power for us. Alright, let's quickly siege down this one as well. Only a couple months, because it's barely defended. Because the AI never builds any sort of actual fortifications. Don't even need to finish it off. Wonderful. Let's grant this one. Oh, this is a pretty well-made castle. Got a lot of stuff in it. Give it to a Stormlander. Thirteen months. In diplomacy, let's go for uh, getting my kids some extra skill points. My alliance with Renly. I don't think I had an alliance with Renly, but Renly's now dead. And is replaced by his son. Renly, who would not want an alliance. Really? Because of my current amount of alliances. Ah, oh, I see, I see. Yeah. Okay, maybe losing Jojen will make you want an alliance. <laughs> no, but you're sl going to be slightly more accustomed to it with each death. So, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> I can wound her just by attacking her. I thought we we haven't we stopped being rivals like eight times now. I think the game just kind of forgets that. I've clicked stop being rivals with her like a million times by now. I can declare war on Renly. For Lord Roderick. I don't care about Lord Roderick. Well, we don't care about you, we'll grant you back to a Stormlander. But I see I've got four or four now, which means what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to revoke this title, which they'll say automatically yes to. We have Dragonmont back. I love Dragonmont. Very, very good title to hold. We build it up a lot, and now it's ours again. And look at that. The Spandle. Wonderful. And we're going to give the Diaden to just another random... Stormlander. And as for your duchy title, I just need the gold. Hmm. Okay, rejects the counter offer. I kind of wanted him to because I wanted to keep the gold. Sure, you can. I don't need a cap. You can have the cap. 
Oh, what wonderful, generous gifts that you gave me that I'm totally not going to immediately use to make a High Lordship. I don't have diet then. Oh, bugger. <laughs> right, I need to actually have diet then. I didn't. Okay, I'll take it a year away. I forgot you need to directly hold the capital for whatever reason, which is a little stupid. I think a little bit that shouldn't be the case, but... There's something about it that just feels a little off to me. All of that. We'll move Donald there. And put Fowl there. It's always Lord... Lord Quillen's been in my courtroom like a hundred times already. Keeps asking for more stuff. When did I give you this title? I just have to guess, I guess. Yeah, I've been on full speed for a while, but I kind of... I've been on full free speed for the rest of this. And, I don't know, last, the last two episodes had basically no combat, so I'm fine going a little faster. Surely it's been a year now. <gasps> it hasn't. Oh, it has six texts a month, though. It's good to know. Uh, no, I'm not going to do more. I, I've already learned that I've had too many. So, wait. You're set to inherit what? The High Lordship of Eastwald. Well, I don't want to lose land. Can I... He's not my direct vassal. God damn it. Do something about it, Roderick, you fool. There's a plan to murder my, my daughter, Lady Jane. Can't let that happen. I don't, why am I so dumb at getting a year? I should just looked at when the start of the year was and been like, boom. Go with that. Lord Donald the Brave. Accept your generous gifts, Lord Bottle. You want... Where? Where? Okay, but that wouldn't put me at war with Renly. Why would I do that? It's always so weird the options they give, because they basically just tell you, hey, this person isn't liked by, by the aura uh, head of faith right now, so... You know, move in on that. But it's it's such it's so much awkward how they're just like Yeah, you can go to war with like all these people, right? <laughs> like Grandview, also in the Stormlands. Totally normal. I dare you to not accept. Good boy. Right, let's make this high lordship then. I'm going to grant you Diaden and that High Lordship. Look at that. Wonderful. Yeah, now I can attack these two. Oh, I can't attack you because you're the Veil. Bloody hell. How did the Veil get that one? Yeah, let's siege the... The Jure lands. I don't really want to go to war with the Vale over this land. So there's a the one little snag in all of this, but it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. I don't really want their pyre, their uh, their banner. I don't think the how strong box is going to be long on the mind of remembrance there. <laughs> Ah, the mighty tale of our strong box. Surprised you don't know of it. I'll teach Jenny. Or Jane, however it's pronounced. Stormlander is clearly superior. 
I don't need to learn other languages. My son can go. He, apparently, my son learned Valyrian earlier, so. Good on him. There we go, look at this. The Lord Paramountcy of Dragonstone grows even stronger now. Though, Lord Faerun is probably going to struggle to keep up power here. So, will we be able to push our claim? Being uh, Faith of the Seven means at least people finally like us. Who knows, that could be a chance. Either way, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I certainly have. Uh, if you guys leave a comment. Well, please leave a comment. I love reading comments. <laughs> if you're enjoying the series, leave a comment. Let me know. And uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I'll see you all next time. Until then.